One of the hardest hit areas appears to be Walworth County. The National Weather Service will be there today to determine whether there was a tornado. The Sheriff's Office tells WISN 12 News the possible tornado was reported around 9:15 last night near Highway 120 and Medea Street. That's in the town of Lyons, just north of Lake Geneva. Authorities say a small industrial park in Lyons was damaged, and this is new video from overnight showing crews working along Highway 120. We're told there are numerous downed power lines in the area could be closed until noon today while crews make repairs. We found more storm damage south of that area in the city of Lake Geneva. This is video from outside the Aurora Health Center on Geneva Square. Dozens of trees were knocked down, signs were bent, and here's an incredible sight. A metal chair ended up wrapped around a tree. WISN 12 News talked to the property manager about what happened. It looks like we had a tornado or some sort of microburst. You see, it came through the two buildings, went around it, and it looked like it really tore some big trees. Just turned them like a pretzel. Unbelievable. Thankfully, the health center itself wasn't badly damaged, and crews climbed onto the roof to look for any problems. But everything appears to be just fine. 12 News reporter Hillary Mentz and meteorologist Jeremy Nelson are in Walworth County this morning. Let's start our live team coverage with Jeremy. And Jeremy, what are you seeing right now out there? Hey, good morning. We're in Lake Geneva, specifically at Geneva Square. Behind us is the Aurora Healthcare Center, which last night had a lot of tree damage. A couple signs were blown over. You can see that sign is still bent. A lot of the cleanup was underway last evening. Already by 10 o'clock, they had the chainsaws out here. And look at some of those tree stumps off in the distance. And you can see that cleanup from the video you're looking at right now, just outside the Aurora Healthcare Center last night, where dozens of trees are down in the Geneva Square area this morning. Again, some of those were cleaned up last night, but the winds in this part of Lake Geneva, the National Weather Service will be out here a little bit later today, and they'll do their storm damage assessment survey. And if I had to uh, put a number on it right now, this looking at some of the damage, probably around an EF0 to EF1 tornado. If it does turn out to be a tornado, and looking at some of the damage here, and also the uh, radar images we had last night, that does appear to be likely. We'll continue to scan the area. There's a lot of activity going on this morning, so certainly let the crews do their business, get things cleaned up, and hopefully you can go on with your day down in this part of Walworth County. We'll continue with our live coverage in just a few minutes. Back to you.